Hello everyone, this is Puriya Sadegi here. I'm a luxury real estate agent here in Vancouver. And today I'd like to share with you guys an interesting topic that I've been working on since the beginning of 2021. I've been creating a series of videos called in and out show with Puria. Because of my construction background, I think we can appreciate more of some of the details that goes through uh, some of the most expensive homes here in Vancouver. I will also be taking you guys through some of the interesting and expensive homes currently listed in the market in Vancouver. At the same time, eventually we will be creating more tutorial videos showing you guys how you can create your real estate portfolio with having just a little bit of money into seven figures. I will also be doing giveaways at the end of each episode to keep me motivated and you guys motivated to watch these videos and share them with you guys. Now, it's time to go watch the first episode. Let's go. Hi, welcome to the first episode of in and out with Puria. Today, I'd like to take you guys on a tour of this brand new built home in West Vancouver, British Properties neighborhood. Let's go check it out. This tastefully designed and masterfully built home sits on a 14,000 square feet flat lot with a frontage of 100 and offers over 7,000 square feet of indoor living on three expansive levels. One of the great exterior features of this home is that the 85% of the exterior of this property is covered with natural cedar wood. This is one of the most expensive products you can find out there to cover the exterior of a property. Not just because of the price of the cedar wood, but also because it takes a long time for the wood to look like this. Also, you need to have an amazing carpenter to be able to give you the V-joint on the corners that the wood meets each other. Now that you're more familiar with the exterior finishing of this home, you can imagine how hard it is to build this double skylight ceiling with the actual skylight sitting on the roof and the opening on the main floor. One of the great features of this property that I would like to mention is the construction and the combination of steel, wood and concrete. As you know, more than 90% of the homes in Vancouver are built by wood. But this home has been built with steel, concrete, and wood. That's how they have been able to have this 40 feet long opening to be able to put two 20 feet wide windows to be able to connect the interior and exterior of this home together. Now imagine soaking into this heated swimming pool during the summer and jumping into the hot tub, back into the swimming pool, back into the hot tub, and having more than 40 or 50 of your friends hang out here under this patio with built-in six speakers in the ceiling, a barbecue, and when you're done for the day. This 24 feet high foyer with a very interesting light fixture is duplicating the double skylight roofing of the outside. As we enter the home, we have the office on your right which could also be used as a bedroom on the main floor that is great for the elderly people that don't want to go up and down the stairs which has its own ensuite bathroom and the closet. If you don't want to use this as an office, you can certainly place a queen bed in between and use these two as a side bed. Right by the office, we have the powder room or the guest bathroom. <music> As we walk through the home, we enter this very open concept dining, living, and family room with Cusco lightings, wide plank, stained flo engineered flooring, a square shaped gas fireplace, and this massive 10 by 10 fixed panel window to bring in the natural light by the dining table. I just love this feature. Just before I take you guys to see the kitchen, if you can please take a moment to like this video if you really like it and if you want me to continue making these videos and if it's possible to subscribe to my channel. This will help me get motivated to make more of these videos. Thanks. One of the smartest ideas behind this home are these triple glazed exterior windows that can kill almost 99% of the noise when they're all closed. 
Wow, I'm in love with this kitchen. I can't believe this 11 feet wide island that can fit four people has one piece stone countertop with the waterfall feature on each side. And obviously the top of the line appliances like Wolf, Mille and Sub-Zero and natural wood cabinets that is very resistant to damages, water or scratches. And this one piece a window that is overlooking outside to the landscaping. This kitchen is a killer. Just before I go upstairs to show you guys the master bedroom, I'd like to mention this very wide open stairs that is sitting on a still structure and this railing that is one piece welded from the basement to the third floor. Guys, this is only one piece. This is amazing. Let's go check out the master bedroom. And this beautifully done master ensuite with a huge rain shower and this soaker tub and the double sided fireplace that is see through from the master ensuite to the bedroom or vice versa. And we have this oversized master bedroom with the corner to corner glass windows on both sides to bring in the natural light and connect the inside and outside of the master bedroom together. And this very private 700 square feet patio that is situated just for the master bedroom. As you walk down the stairs, we enter this very massive basement that is great for entertaining. We have this built-in onyx wall bar with a 24 bottle display wine cellar and a built-in temperature control wine cooler. We have the dry sauna, sports lounge, a built-in fireplace and your very own elevator to take you upstairs to your master bedroom. Let's not forget about the media room, it's over 600 square feet. These are 10 feet tall barn doors that lead through this massive media room that is completely soundproof. I can hear my own voice in this room. This is absolutely insane. Thank you for watching this video until now. We are finishing off the first episode of In and Out with Puria. I really appreciate everyone that has watched this video. And as a matter of appreciation, I would like to give $500 on my next video for people that subscribe to my channel leave me a comment and like this video and reshare it with their friends. Make sure it's all done through my YouTube because I'm only counting people that are coming on my YouTube channel. Thanks again and until the next time, take care.